Hello and welcome to Hard to Find 4. I did say that I was going to do this episode tomorrow, but I'm doing it now because I've just had a quick look what was going on in the Atlantic and I had this guy already moving. So remember this? We had an order. These guys are invading already, so we will carry this on tonight <laughs> um, so yeah we'll see what we can actually do there um, we've got a couple things that we need to do naval wise um, because this is really why I was having a look through um, we've got stuff being moved around but probably to the wrong areas uh, so it's it's fun and games of course managing all this uh, I suppose um, I'm going to have those on there, we're going to have those on there. Uh, let's not have them on there because that keeps on uh, throwing my uh, appreciation of that fleet out the window really. Uh, I'm going to have... Where are they? They're on this side aren't they? I'm uh, going to have more over here. They're done, okay. Uh, we will have them uh, probably patrol actually uh, yeah, we've got those being worked on there and we uh, we'll keep them in that little group um, we'll see if we can put some more ships out there no I said ships Couple, well we've got one battleship one heavy cruiser there one light cruiser some destroyers all well and good. Uh, yeah, I did move this. I'm sure I moved this out to here. So we did move them there. They haven't got any active regions, so they should be over here. So I want convoy escorting in this area because their ships are non-existent. Well, I say that. They've got 41 ships. We know, well, yeah, we've got 100% on there. So we know they've got nine battleships, five carriers, five destroyers, six heavy cruisers and six light cruisers and four submarines. So they are out there somewhere and I have seen where a couple of them are. So there are two ships awaiting repairs there. And there is some ships there. So the USS Wasp, that was a carrier. Uh, so we can do stuff there. Um, right, air wars. Air wars. Okay, so Alaska. Currently, uh, it's just our fighters over there, but they have got enemy fighters in this area. So if we can get some aircraft there, which we have got the close air support from Italy are there, which is very nice, but. But, I know, I know what you're thinking. Um. Oh, let's use these and ye I think yeah that should be a good combination actually right we'll have them out there if they come in that way and that is going to be their goal do that and take those aircraft down there um, we're working out in this area, loads to actually deal with there. Not so many there, but well, it's still not in our favor. So we'll see what we can actually do there. We are working out there quite nicely at the moment. Uh, what about our bombers? So look, uh, let's get them doing that mission because that might help. And yeah, they're working into there. Okay. Right, we've currently got aircraft there that can't do what they need to. So I'm going to move them into a more lucrative position for there. Uh, they're all doing what they need to. Okay. So we'll see what happens there. But... In the meantime, we've got an army group over here, sat, waiting, okay. 
not brilliant supplies, so we need to get some of them moved. Um, how do we do it? If we do... No, we're not going to do... Well, we could do it from everywhere, really, but... Right, you. I'm going to do that. And then we're going to use islands around in these areas. Now, I don't like going for areas where I haven't got uh, a port, but we could use this. I'm not confident in using that, to be honest, but we could use that. Um, saying that, we've still got this area, so that would be a good one to attack. We just need islands to actually attack it from, so Japanese have quite nicely given us a few options here. So that's going to be eight getting into these areas. Does mean that I'm going to have to have my naval forces just move around, but do we, we know that there's the Americans there, but do we do that anyway, just to keep them pinned down so that they're on the way? Even if they fail at that, they could still use these areas. That's what I'm thinking. But these guys need to get better supply from where they are at the moment, up in there. So getting them across there, we won't launch them, not yet. Uh, I did move another troop out here. So let's move him down to there. Get rid of that. I am seriously tempted in Los Angeles, but I don't have the facility for doing it, not yet. So Those islands are a bit too far away. But they will be support for this area, I reckon. Uh, now, we were moving those back, so we will have those three. Just stay there. And what else have we got going on? We've got... Oh, okay. More Russian divisions. Factories. All well and good. Uh, no, 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 no. It, well, yeah, we are going to need them, but... But wow, Hungary really landed on their fleet with all of the um, aluminium there. Okay, um, that was still going on in the Aegean, it looks like that. Uh, we've got air experience, so improve our heavy fighters again, maybe, because we're still using the fucker wolf at the moment. Um, well, that takes the reliability down. What's the range? Pretty good. Well, 
we'll have that. Can you improve the armoured car? Wow, you can. Okay. Doesn't help with suppression, though. See, if you click on these in black eyes, you can do stuff with these. Apart from just rename it. Yeah. No. Um, right. That said, let's get back to the action because these guys were moving in. May have to use these guys to support this attack down here. But we have got these as well. Uh, uh, what's thinking about these is what we've got we've got supremacy there so it is possible that we could get in there with our troops Will they see that coming? I don't know, but we would reduce the amount of planes in the area, so it may be worth doing just for that reason alone. it will actually take them to do that. Oh, they're going through. Okay, that's pretty strange. Right, they're not getting any kind of problems with supply there, so... We're going to need a bulk of an army to hold essentially that. So we'll try with those. And I'm going to need other troops to come over. So I have got spare troops here. Those could go with him. I don't know where where he is. Oh, he's out here. Okay. Right, they can go there. And then this guy. What we... We have him do that. And then that. That gives us some troops already out there if they need some backup. Yeah, right. Carry on. Resistance. I can't believe it. Um. So there's something in the dev diary about kind of less drift defense in it. Okay. Maybe they don't apply to a game that's already in progress. Not sure. I 
I mean, if we get that port there, it may be worth just doing that order immediately. Uh, I will move him there, and then he can be on there. Just don't know where they are. Where are you going? Oh, you're going back, okay. Can we build anything there yet? No, okay. That's annoying because my guys are running out of steam now. Oh, yeah, that would be really bad. Mind you, if they could skirt round them, I don't think that's going to happen because they're just going to get clobbered by them now. We can't even put a fort up, can we? Nope. Oh, hold on, we can. It's showing... Oh, right, okay, that's just the particular... Some of a... Oh, I can't do that, but I can do a fort. Okay, that's weird. It's literally, you can build some things, but you can't others. Okay, so, well, there you go. That's a bit of... Uh... Exercise in futility, I suppose. Um, they are doing what? They it's two against one at the moment. Okay. And wow. Okay, it's ten to one there, and yeah, it shows as well. which is where we need to kind of reduce areas like this. How far are we off? We're nearly there, okay. That's oh, a field marshal in it, sorry. Oh, there's three divisions there. May have to rethink this plan just to go just for the French bit so I can get the case sent on. I, I did say I was going to do that, but I didn't change the plan over. Sorry. No, nope, they're going nowhere. We're not even shifting the British divisions, so they're going to be thinking, ha ha. We got them. No, you haven't. Um, all of you stop. Uh, I've lost the islands, believe it or not. Um, no, you should be able to come back there. Thank you. While they're making their way back. We'll get the order settled. Right, what were we catching out here? Nothing brilliant. Okay, it's port strikes really. I want to start hitting their navy, wherever it is. They... have only got... what? Oh, we've lost naval supremacy there. That's what it's telling me. 
Right, you guys. We can't do those not yet, can we? Because that is him. No, that's not him. That's him. They're still on the way. Okay. Yeah, come over here. Ruin your supply. Just take your own attrition. That's fine. My guys have not got that problem because I've got German engineers behind me. You just don't tell them that we're not getting all of the supply at the moment. Okay. I think we're going to get our asses handed to us here because these guys are going to get pushed all the way back. Damn those numbers. What are we facing? Oh my god. It's just ground support as well. Yeah. This is why you need an airfield. The even carrier operations wouldn't have helped there. Right, you guys, forget that as an order. Just come back there. Come off that front line. Just break that contact with them. They're moving, though. <laughs> They're moving. They're saying, oh, no, 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 it's, it's ours. And they've got 24 divisions there now. I don't think I've ever seen a placement of 24 divisions on one port before. Not unless you're moving troops out. Okay, that being said... We're going to have to evacuate from uh, Mexico, then I'm going to have to do multiple landings all at the same time. Uh, what else have we got? Oh, yes. You lot. Get up to there. use that territory as an invasion spot it's really terrible though and I've been bombing the hell out of it so maybe not such a good idea they're moving back right what do we do with our Mexican forces I think we get them out of there I think I think we pushed it a bit too far with them. Uh, so let's retreat them back to here, to Tokyo. Uh, 
I think he built up a couple of his stats and doing that, but yeah, that's just, I can't do anything with that area, so we'll see what we can do elsewhere, but we really need to eliminate their air, and yeah, that's what we're facing now. Hmm. Yes. Hmm. I don't know who is going to be left on the list. Have we got any other countries? No. There you go. Australia is on the way out. Iran took most of India. So it's all to play for, I suppose. Uh, I'm not going to need it, I don't think, but, but, okay, um, right, hopefully those guys can disengage from the, I'm, I'm sorry, what, Turkey joins the allies? Turkey joins the Allies. Are you sure about that? This is no faction. We still got military access to them, so how does that work out? I'm really not sure about that. That's you, isn't it? Okay. Um, who are you? Where are you? Oh, you're there. No, I'm redeploying you elsewhere, so... you guys are going to have a really crappy job to do. Being on that line. Get in there. Yeah, okay, so not sure what's going on there. All right, well, well, we've got loads of rail guns when it comes to it. Uh, not that we need them. Oh, railway guns, I should stop saying rail guns because that's something completely different. those things up while we're there. One goes one way, one goes the other. No, just all sit there. Halt. Right, reinforcements are on the way. Oh, come on, you guys, just retreat. 
Yeah, you you are you are getting out of there if you can. Okay. Good. Oh, he's on the way that way? Oh, he is. Okay. Got to watch that with your naval invasions. If you've got them going on elsewhere, you need to pay attention to them. Right, can't get any more that way. Got those going on. What are we actually sure of? I think these extra factories are coming from our minions. Wow. That's it. Back to Japan, please. Get out of the way. Right, one of you guys can do that and then do that. And then do that just in case they have any sneaky ideas of doing that. We'll get rid of that so that it's just that line. Yeah, I see that as an invasion point. Since we can't get elsewhere. But we need to draw these aircraft out now. And they probably can outproduce me quite easy at this stage. Okay, so more of their ships have gone under. And I've no idea about the amounts there. But if they're not getting any rubber supplies in, which they are, yeah, their aircraft production would eventually get hit, but it would take longer than 1946, I reckon. Right, what kind of territory is this three? Just notice there's another port there. Right, I'm going to make a 
decision to put them on there. Might lead this to another group and get these guys in America. Because we haven't got any naval support out there, which I think is causing the problem. No, it's not going anywhere, is it? Okay. Stop. Forget that. Just cancel all of those, please. Can use your assistance over here. Go. We really, really need to do that every single move. Oh, hold on. No, that would be the better move. And that would be the better move. Still working up, good. That's just fighters in the area, isn't it? We're keeping three hundred fighters because we of our hundred bombers. What kind of range have they got from there? Mm. Hold on, they're not with it. It's not them that I wanted to move, it's just them, thank you very much. Let's have them, well, attack everywhere there. That's a fair distribution. Right, that's what I want. Anything that looks like a threat, basically. Oh, we can go for another area. And that's a lot of fighters. What are we there? I think this is going to be a blanket order for all of them, actually. We 
we've got tactical bombers there. Have we got any more strategic bombers? No, not really. Okay. Quite a few tank bombers though, so. How many can we do? Oh, quite a few. I want you to ruin the American positions. And where do we want to hit? There, to start off with. Uh, okay. Let's see about getting into here, maybe? Oh, we can't use that. Oh, hold on. That's United Kingdom. Sorry, I was thinking that was Venezuela. Right there on the way out there. Okay, yeah, we're not going to do anything with that particular group there. I will use another group. But where? Who can tell? What I want is the Japanese to stop fighting in China or get it over with and get their troops onto the coasts of America. that five come from well against their ground forces well, we're okay but they are li limited numbers up here that's the thing What I need is another naval invasion, really, around a port where it, there's an airfield. I wonder if these guys can hold that line up there. Then I use this guy from his multiple regions. Where do we hit? Really needs to support that. So maybe Boston? Uh, there's a task force there. Hit New York and then go for, well that is, yeah, there's all the bridges there, isn't there? So, Decisions, decisions. I think a supporting attack into here. Where else have we got? We've got. We know we can put six there. Okay. 
Ups. I think I can get away with doing that. Maybe. Uh, right, how were these out here? They're all fully supplied now, but. Right, Mexican forces are back there. Still wanted that area. I really want that area. I'm gonna be like a dog without his bone on that. Uh, what the hell's going on here? They are ruining themselves. For what reason? It's pretty strange. He says go though. Okay. Can we move you in? I don't think so. Really need that to happen before we do another naval invasion, but I really want to get into here if I can. Divert their resources everywhere. Wow, okay. I don't think we'd stand a chance there saying that. Uh, where are we? We are up here, aren't we? 200 so far. Uh, okay. I think it's time to bring more aircraft in. Who have we got? What about those? Those can both move. So can they. And they're transport planes. I don't really want them. I will take them though. Where do we want them? No, they can't do it, not yet. Okay. You're still doing that. Uh, yep, they should all move. Two thousand there. We're not exploiting that enough. Right, you guys are moving in, aren't you? Right, you on the front line. And just hold. And we'll see whether we can just faint them into kind of just thinking one area is the attack and then we do another attack. Do you really want to get into these areas though? Yeah, they're waiting for me. Uh, 
comet sighted. Okay. <laughs> the end is in here for our enemies. Okay. Not bad as a bridgehead. Get radar worked up. Anti air worked up. Infrastructure. What was that dockyard? Yes. Yeah, we can build that up. I thought there was already an airfield over here. Okay, I will take that. And there are destroyers out here. Right, they're doing all of their jobs quite correctly. They don't know where to go, so. Let's have them over here. They can do that. They can hit there. They can hit there. Where are they? They haven't got enough range at the moment. Oh, there, there is the airfield. We have got that airfield out in Greenland that we can use. Okay, they're doing what they're supposed to be doing, although it is going to be costing us in the aircraft now. Well, and pilots. Nobody really cares about the pilots though, do they? They have got aircraft to spare. Yep. They're still getting that in, they are. It's going to be a bit of a slog, this. Um, we did see nuclear reactors just come up on the board, though, didn't we? So... Everybody wants a nuclear reactor in their backyard, so I'm going to have them everywhere. Although previous experiences with nuclear weapons in this, it's not good. Okay. 
didn't it say that they'd actually joined the allies uh, that doesn't make sense okay i say okay but it's not okay uh, it's confusing that's what it is uh where's our next maneuvers it's this guy in it um him. still loads moving though how are we doing on time we're getting to the end of the episode seriously we haven't beaten the americans by i don't know 1946 we'll call it a stalemate because there's only so much you can do They beat us, though. That's a different story. Yeah, we have got planes in reserve, so let's get some built up. Okay, what have we got out there? Are they close? They're different close air support. Okay. have you here let's put you to work right what have we got then we've got, telling me we've got all these aircraft what have we got we have got quite a few not the figures that I really wanted Scout aircraft were okay on naval bombers, I suppose. Oops, I could get some more of those. I've just taken him off that order. Right, who are you? What are you? You're not doing a lot there. So come out and join the party. Let's see if we can gain the air. Okay, they're doing that. What, who else have we got? What else have we got? Because this is where you just go into the game, select your aircraft, and then suddenly people appear out of nowhere and can fly planes. Hmm, strange that. Uh, let's have those built up. I know, I'm so cynical. What else we got? Because fighters are going to be important. So we may as well get the pilots trained up to do those jobs. There's going to be 900 pilots instantly available. What? Doesn't make sense. Or are they all going to be controlling the fighter aircraft from their homes? Right, that draws us down on those. What else have we got? Have some of those. Right, we'll see what our fuel situation is after all that, because that's going to be quite a lot. We'll have a look at the naval situation, because we haven't looked at that for, well, decades. Um, I 
You shouldn't be on that. None of you should be on that. You should just go back if you need to. Breaking my ships, the little gits. Uh, let's have another group. Yep, you definitely need training up. Yep. Keep an eye on your navy, otherwise, this happens. They should all reinforce if they need to. Okay, you, I did move out to Bermuda. You're still there. Good. You're waiting for me and my orders to get into these areas. Because apparently they've come up with 12 ships, which they have got them. They have lost a few battleships, though, somewhere along lines, uh, along with their uh, cruisers as well. Wow. One of the biggest navies down to Eek. Yeah, I don't really want to see figures kind of just building up there against me. What I want is all you lot in position. You're not, though. Right, you're getting there. Okay. Right, how are we doing? Out here. 21 ships. Okay. Right, the ships that are doing this area. Just do that. Not sure why they were carrying on training, but I'd obviously clicked the wrong thing on that. Right, we need all of those areas covered. Which probably means we need to split the force up. have more out there maybe no yeah we could um, we'll have them on that for that Do one more. Okay, that's him maxed out. Just in case we need any more support. Oh, he's already doing that. That's fine. Move along then. Uh, so, in the next episode, because it's going to have to be the next episode, we'll do yet another naval invasion of America. And we'll see whether we can actually survive this, because that is looking very dodgy. 
We're okay there. It's here. We need to move on to the next. We, yeah, we need to move into New England, really. Um, but hopefully this naval invasion actually solves that and we can actually do an invasion from that side. I have got ships out here. What are they doing? They're not doing a lot at the moment because they are not working properly. But I have got ships here that are ready to do a support mission there. Um, take them off that. And they can be out there as well. And then we've got not enough ships to actually do convoy escorting jobs off that coast. But we need to get into these and start reducing their production to do everything. That, as a figure, I think has gone down, but we have captured a few there. That, I don't think, will ever go down. So we will see what we can do, but we've got a tall order to take down that lot. Answers on a postcard, if you know the answer to that one. But there you go, I'll leave you with the uh, spectral signs of our tentacles going to hit America in the next episode. Uh, that is the cop now, so I'll see you in that episode. See you later, bye.